four foot eleven and a quarter. Yep, I'm under five feet. That's tiny, I know. And growing up, I suffered from acute comparisonitis. I compare myself to these tall, willowy girls at school. You know the type, the ones who look like they stepped out of the pages of a fashion magazine. And when I first started my business, I was infected with comparisonitis again. It didn't matter how hard I worked, I felt like a failure because there was always someone more successful than me. Then. I found the cure. I began to see comparison for what it actually is, a spotlight showing you the truth about what you really want. I realized that I didn't want to be taller. I wanted to feel more confident. I didn't want to get ahead of other entrepreneurs. I wanted to go for bigger goals. When you're honest with yourself, comparison becomes inspiration and you'll never get infected again. Do you suffer from comparisonitis? What is it telling you about what you want? Comment below. Be sure to like, follow, and subscribe. And if you know someone who'll enjoy this, hit the share button, pass it on, and share the love.